Okay, before I run the program, what I'm doing here is I'm going to slow down the run to give me time to talk about what's happening here. So I'll put a one second delay in. Then I will start running the program. Here's a warning just telling me that there's going to be a one second delay in each tool measurement. Here the machine was measuring two manual points, or what would have been two manual points, to help line up the part. Now it's measuring the, the front edge of the part to do a quick alignment on the part. Now it's measuring the top surface of the part to get a Z-height measurement along the uh, center of the part to tell if the part's tilted up or down in Z or kind of up and down uh, from the glass stage. And now it's measuring the left edge of the part on the equator. It's going to do that on the left side. It's going to repeat the measurements on the right side and then get a center line between those two edges. And it will use that to determine if the part's um, skewed or rotated on the glass. And it uses these measurements to set the Z height also. And you can see it's focusing at each point for the Z height and then does the actual edge measurement. Now that the alignment's done, the machine is measuring points on the right-hand edge for three different diameters, and then it repeats those measurements on the left edge. It combines the measurements on the right and on the left to determine the diameters, and the diameters print out at the bottom of the screen. That's it.